I thought it would be really fun to make a creepy crawly spider. Oh. What if you put that in your dressing room? Would they like it? They would love it. Yeah? They would love okay, it. Okay, so it's not so hard to make this creepy crawly spider, and, uh, and it is um, a, a fabulous creation made out of chicken wire, a little wood, some electrical tape, and plastic garbage bags. So it sounds like fun. And, mm. uh, and I thought I'd show uh, Rosie how to do it. Want to learn? Yes, okay. I would love okay. to. So this is a little piece of wood, which okay. is really what's going to hold the legs of the spider. And we've cut a piece of um, uh, chicken wire, just plain old chicken wire. And we've Oh, yeah, and where do you get plain old chicken wire? Hardware anymore? store. Hardware store. Oh, okay. And you can even, I think Gracious Homes even has chicken wire. Oh, okay. Don't Fabulous underestimate store. New York. New York, you can get almost anything. There's a lumber yard at 100 and... No, 96th Street and uh, 2nd Avenue or 1st Avenue. I know all the lumber yards. I know all those places. Oh, you, can, cool. you can really find stuff. So we're going to staple this down, and hopefully it will catch. Yeah, there. Hmm, we're missing. Anyway, this is going to be where the legs are attached. There. Fine. Finally. Just keep stapling this down, and on this side, too. Fold it up. Then you tuck this in to make this round body. The legs are made out of this uh, wonderful armature wire. This is 1 8 inch in diameter. It's just plain, easily malleable aluminum wire. And we're, we've covered it with black electrical tape, all available at the hardware store on, on 96th Street and 2nd Avenue. Okay. okay. So, um, so here is your, um, the body. Uh, here is the, the skeleton, the sp uh, actually kind of the spine. And here are the legs. So once you get a leg formed like that, we're going to use these to hold on. So you put your, put your leg on oh. there, uh -huh. okay? My leg, I got my leg. Yep. And then we're going to uh, just attach this leg with our little oh, I could do this. The fastener. And you just pull this through tight. Yeah, there, and any excess you're gonna cut off, whereas my, just use a wire cutter. Okay, yeah, good. And then clip off the excess. These are so handy to have around. You have a lot of drawer full of these at home, right? Yes. These fasteners, good. I okay. do, because I'm so crafty. So, uh, I'm more of a cook than a crafter. Oh, you are? Oh, so that's good. Yeah. Well, we, but crafting is fun when this you have is fun. something like this to do, okay? Then you turn this over. This is so easy. I was a little intimidated by these. And now we are going to start making the puffy body of the spider. So use a little of, and we've cut garbage bags into squares. These are like six inch squares. You could use eight inch squares. Uh, use your little Hefty? adhesive, um, whatever. <laughs> whatever, no, spray first. Oh, this is a spray adhesive. Don't breathe it, just spray it. Now take your little squares of black plastic and just push them down like that so they stick up like that and you're going to go through the entire, every oh, single, so cool. every single hexagon of the chicken wire is going to have an implant of plastic. Oh. Yes. Okay, and if I could do this, y'all could do this. Oh, of course. This is fabulous. Isn't this fun? Yes, and I feel fabulous. Yes, I feel good. very Martha Stewardess. And, but don't, <laughs> stewardess. And don't uh, miss any little oh. spot, okay? Just put it in there. Now, uh, we have to make the legs. The legs so far have been, this is what it looks like when you've stuffed it with black plastic bag, like this. Then you take this nice tinsel, black tinsel, and you wrap it around the uh, arachnid's legs. And two pieces will do, and do it pretty, pretty tightly so it doesn't fall off. Okay. Finish the leg. And uh, I love how these look. And the heads are fun to make too, Rosie, because you're making them out of just styrofoam balls. And uh, you can start again in the middle and finish it with the second piece. Just wrap all the way around. There. Very good. So now the, the heads themselves are these balls, and you have to draw like a mouth. Spiders have kind of large mouths. Okay. And you, yeah, and, so, and then you're going to just draw it on there so you have a mouth. Okay. And then use a melon baller to scoop out the styrofoam. <laughs> so now take the, we've already hollowed the mouth out make-believe, and we've already glittered with oh, black right. on the outside, red on the inside, and we have these two ruby eyes. 
And uh, you can use, oh, ah, that's why the hot glue gun is here. You can use the hot glue gun to affix the eyes to wherever you think a spider's eyes belong. I was using glue. Oh, oh don't burn yourself. Okay. If no, you I do burn yourself, gun. do you see this little bowl of ice? Uh-huh. Put your finger in the ice if you burnt your finger. Oh, that's so small. So you don't put it in your mouth and burn your mouth, okay? Okay. Okay, so now, oh, teeth. Now, this is clever. Um, what would you make teeth for a, a spider out of? Well, we're um. using, we're using Nails. These oh, are fake ghetto, nails. Awesome. Look, ghetto, ghetto. <laughs> You're using fake oh, nails? Oh, fake nails. And we've glittered them. We've just put, dipped them in a little glue and put a little glitter on them. And here you have sparkly teeth. So now just put them, if you want pointy teeth, you, you put the flat end in and just stick it right up into the mouth. And you have to hold it there for a second. You just make a hole first. Shove it in. Oh, okay. Then that's why they shove the points in because the flat end does not shove in very okay. easily. So find the pointy end of the and just push it right in like that. Ah, oh, lovely. This, See, this little sucker doesn't want to go in. Oh, <laughs> it'll go in. You have to push okay, okay, really okay, hard. Okay, yeah, it. you got it. And uh, and then when you're finished inserting the teeth, you know you have to not make it look silly. Not too silly. And here's a head that's already done. Yeah, it looks good. So then, remember, we have two nails at the, in the uh, spine and just stick this head on right on the two nails. And then you bend Wait. the legs oh, oh, okay. of the spider. Make, give them an elbow and a foot. And you can make it tall or squat, whichever way you want to make your spider stand up. See how cute? Very cute. And uh, there you have it.